The phrase wait for Vega has been thrown around a lot this year, and there's been a lot of hype about what the latest graphics cards from AMD have to offer. Unfortunately, even we had to wait for Vega, A stock on these cards has been so tight. The crypto miners have been snapping up everything, especially AMD cards, and what stock was left was snapped up by eager gamers trying to get to them before the miners do. Thankfully, we stuck to our guns, waited out the storm, and finally got a brand new ASUS ROG Strix RX Vega 64 OC graphics card with 8 gig gigabytes of HBM2 memory, Aura Sync RGB lighting, and all those other buzzwords that gamers love so much. First impressions of this card are good. It's pretty big thanks to their huge triple fan cooler, which of course features the patented Wingblade Zero decibel fans, which are said to be dust resistant as well. But thankfully it's not very wide, so it shouldn't cause too many issues with those who are tight on space. Size-wise, it measures in at 11.73 inches by 2.58 inches by 2.07 inches. ASUS fans will know what to expect here, as the cooler is one of the more established designs. But hey, if it isn't broke, don't fix it. This also includes an improved heatsink surface, giving up to 30% cooler temperatures and three times quieter gaming performance. This oversized cooler with its big surface area combined with those three powerful fans gives users the perfect storm for pushing those factory overclocks. That means less throttling on the GPU and keeping those frame rates gloriously high. The cooler is pretty big though, so be sure to measure your chassis twice, just to make sure you have got room for it. Another key feature is the ASUS Fan Connect 2 technology which features two four pin hybrid controlled headers that can be connected to both PWM and DC system fans to give the very best system cooling. This can be tweaked on a per system basis therefore giving the most efficient cooling possible. RGB lighting is all the rage, you either rage for it or about it, but it's a feature that's here to stay. You'll find a bunch of gorgeous LED lights on the cooler side and an awesome RGB ASUS ROG logo on that thick and stylish backplate too. On the top the Republica Gamers logo lights up nicely and of course it's all Aura Sync compatible so you can match up with any compatible motherboards, coolers, RAM, peripherals and more simply by plugging into the RGB header on the end of the card and controlling it through the ASUS software. There are two HDMI ports on this which is great if you're rocking a monitor and a VR headset such as the HTC Vive as this means you won't need to constantly switch cables when going from one device to the other. There are two display ports and even a DVI port for those who still require it. Whether you're rocking multiple displays, VR headsets or more it will hook up with ease. Power delivery is a bit rich taking two 8 pin connectors but that's no fault of ASUS as the reference AMD design is exactly the same and we know that historically AMD cards are usually a bit more thirsty than their Nvidia counterparts. Parts. Of course, with this card having a big overclock, it's easily going to need more power than virtually any Vega 64 on the market at the moment. Differences between this card and the reference doesn't just stem down to the cooler, as it comes pre-overclocked at 1,298 MHz, with a GPU boost clock of 1,000 590 megahertz. The 8 gig of HBM2 memory also has a bit of a boost. It's sporting a 945 megahertz clock. While this isn't a huge overclock from the stock reference design, it's enough to squeeze every last bit of performance out of the GPU while keeping temperatures and noise modest. Of course, users wanting to push things even further can do so via the GPU Tweak 2 software, which offers one-click overclocking and even a professional mode for those who want to go even more extreme. Now let's get it hooked up and take a look at what kind of performance the Vega 64 has to offer.
for now. I hope you enjoyed the video and until next time, remember to subscribe to get more great video content directly to your inbox. Give us a like and a comment and I will see you in the next video. See you later.